Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Melody Storytelling of 2020 Best Chinese Fantasy Drama. I'm super excited because there's going to be a lot of great upcoming Chinese fantasy dramas, so let's get started. Three Lives, Three Worlds, The Pillow Book, also known as Internal Love of Dream. This is a sequel to The Ten Miles of Peach Blossom. The Pillow Book tells a story of two immortals going through three lives of love and hardship. Yang Mi from Ten Miles of Peach Blossom will be in some parts of this drama. Internal Love of Dream has a total of 56 episodes and I can't wait for all the episodes to come out. Sword Dynasty Sword Dynasty tells the story of an era where people talk with their sword instead of their mouth. Every swordsman must use their sword to gain their desire to become the best sword master. Li Yitong plays the main female Li and Li Xian plays the main male Li. Li Xian became super popular after his modern drama with Yang Zi. Sword Dynasty has a total of 34 episodes. Legend of Fei Wang Yibo plays the main male Li. You guys probably remember Wang Yibo from The Untamed, which was one of the most popular Chinese fantasy drama of 2019. His character in The Legend of Fei is totally opposite from his character in The Untamed. Zhao Ling plays the female Li and her character in The Legend of Fei is very similar to her character in Princess Agent. There's a lot of fighting scenes in this drama and I'm super excited to watch this drama. Legend of Fei has a total of 50 episodes. The Golden Hairpin The Golden Hairpin tells the story of the main female Li played by Yang Zi, accused of murdering her family and goes through a series of investigations. The director of this drama also directed Ten Miles of Peach Blossom, The Journey of Flower, Love and Destiny, and so many more. Wu Yifang is the main male Li. He was a former member of a Korean K-pop group EXO. I am very excited to watch this drama, especially when I knew Yang Zi will be the main female Li. The Golden Hairpin has a total of 60 episodes. The Killing of 3000 Crow tells the story of a princess from a defeated dynasty that was saved by the main male Li played by Zheng Yechen. This drama tells a heart-wrenching love story between the two main Li's. They are on a quest to search for the spiritual lamb, later to realize that the main male Li is the key to activate the spiritual lamb. But once the spiritual lamb is activated, the key and the activator will perish. This drama has a total of 30 episodes. Love and Redemption This is another great fantasy drama. Love and Redemption tells the story of a girl with a bubbly characteristic losing her six senses. Her character is very similar to Ashes of Love where she doesn't know a thing about love. Love and Redemption has a total of 36 episodes and I'm super excited to watch this. Dolo Continent Dolo Continent tells the story of a boy losing his mother at a very young age and having the talent of martial arts and later becoming a master in the world of martial arts. Xiao Zhang plays the main male Li and Wu Xiangyi played the main female Li. I'm so excited to watch this drama especially because Xiao Zhang is in it. There's a total of 40 episodes. And the winner is Love, Yue Shan Chong Huo. I'm very excited for this drama because finally, Luo Yingxi is going to be the main male lead and hopefully with a happy ending this time. And the winner is Love tells the story of a handsome and smart boy with a weak immune system. After he grew up, he becomes a playboy. However, after meeting the main female lead played by Yuki Chan, he became a very good husband. And The Winner is Love has a total of 50 episodes. The Love Last Two Minds tells the story of the main female Li played by Yuki Chen that lost her memory. To escape her own wedding, she dressed up as a guy and joined an investigation team. This drama has a total of 36 episodes. Spirit Room Spirit Room tells the story of a young man losing his memory and going on a journey with his friend to a path of finding his identity and growing their power. Yang Yun Tai this drama tells the story of a brave and smart girl named Xiao Yingyan who couldn't marry her childhood sweetheart and being forced to marry the emperor. Han Yin plays the main female Li and her character in this drama is very similar to her character in Princess Wei Yang. Dou Xiao plays the main male Li. I really like him after watching Princess Asia. This drama has a total of 50 episodes. That's all for 2020 Best Chinese Fantasy Drama. Please comment below on which drama you are most excited to watch. And please make sure to like and subscribe for more future videos. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video.